Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So today uh, I'm at a special place, which is uh, in the studio. Uh, I would like to thank all you guys who are in the studio. Uh, I I really like the studio, and this is my first episode filming it here. And before I start the video, the game today that I'm playing is called Toilet Roleplay, guys. So I hope you guys enjoy it, and I'll be talking about the new update and other stuff like that. But before I start the video, I want to show you guys something. So uh, remember to uh, like and subscribe and hit that notification bell whenever I post uh, like new videos and other stuff like that on my channels. And uh, before I also start the video, I also want to uh, b say big shouts to these guys who wrote their names on my uh, uh, paper that I told them to write it on. So they want to sponsor this video to help me get like some subscribers and likes. So anyways, guys, that's not the main thing for today's video. Today's video, I'm going to be focused on uh, the new update in this game called Toilet Roleplay. I'll show you everything and uh, I hope you enjoy this game and grab popcorn and uh, coke and enjoy this uh, show. So today I'm filming at studio so uh, still another thank you to them who uh, are like helping me out. So I'm going to be showing you the new update in the Toilet Roleplay so far. It's about Skibbity Toilet from episode uh 70 part 3 and 71 if you guys don't know what skibbity toilet is it's uh human heads in uh toilets which is kind of weird but it's uh my favorite ep like series i should probably say it's kind of creepy at the same time but it's still cool so i'm gonna start off by showing you some morphs that are in the game so let's start off by doing the skibbity toilet multiverse guys skibbity toilet multiverse is like skibbity toilet except it's just multiverse with like weird clock guys so i'm gonna start start off with the large clock man he's pretty cool uh also guys i just wanted to tell you that these morphs actually have uh ability so for example we have the large uh uh, clock man and he's got some abilities and uh, it's, it's not it's like part of the new update because if, if you guys see the signs of on the morph that says new that means it was uh, added to the game so yeah so we're gonna start off here and if you guys wonder what control means it means that uh it's gonna like make the because in the game guys uh in skibbity toilet uh there's like parasite toilets that can infect the morphs or something that's what the description says on the game so yeah so this is the large clock man infected but I'm gonna disinfect him so uh, here he we could also make him run guys but I but for me it, will, it won't like really work so you could also spawn in random places so uh, there's a camera lab but I'm not gonna be spawning in it today guys because to be honest with you uh, last time I uh, played this game it was really glitching so yeah but here, guys, uh, here's him uh, failing his, like, clock thing. And it looks like he failed, I think. Oh, um, wait, that's not him failing. I think that's him, uh, like, pausing time. Cause these guys have a special ability by, like, pausing the toilets. And uh, so they could, like, hurt them and other stuff like that. And here's him uh, failing, I think. Here's him failing. So yeah, that's pretty cool animation. I probably say big shouts to the creator who made this game. I really like the abilities. He also has the ability to shrug, which is pretty cool. And we also got the point clock. So it's him pointing to his clock. And uh, we also got him that he could actually dance, guys. This is the speaker man dance. It's pretty cool, to be honest. Anyways, that's the first morph for today. So we have more to go. So I hope you guys still enjoy it. So next up, we got uh, this morph. This is Clock Woman. She's a, uh, like, Woman Alliance member. That's what they call it. So we can infect her. So I don't want to really infect her. So I'm going to disinfect her. Or actually, no, I, I, here we go. All right, and here she could also punch. She could rewind time, which is cool. So let's see. Oh, that is pretty cool. There's a clock. I didn't know that this morph could do that. And she could also equip a gun. Uh, it's it's not really like a real gun, guys. It's just a fake gun in Roblox. So I have no idea how I'm going to... Oh, here we go. I could shoot it. So it's going to be shooting these like weird blocks or something. I have no idea what it's shooting. And here we can make her dance. But we have another 
uh, one last Skibbity Toilet Multiverse. Uh, uh, we have one last Skibbity Toilet Multiverse uh, morph in here. So we got uh, a Clock Man. He's pretty cool, and he's the like main character of the Multiverse series. So here we can make him uh, infected, and uh, over here we also can disinfect him. Here we go. And we can also make him run, which on this morph it will work. And we can also make him punch and we can make him his clock ability. So that's pretty cool because he's got like a stopwatch on his thing. And we also got, uh, we can equip a tablet because in the series of Multiverse, the clock man had a tablet and it said something. Let me see what this one says. This one says Titan Speaker Man Infected. If you guys don't know, in this series, Titan Speaker Man got infected. So here we also got a knife, which he could swing, and we got the normal Speaker Man dance for him. It's pretty cool, to be honest with you guys, but still, it's the same dance as Speaker Man. So now we're going to go into the normal morphs of the series. So we got the first morph here, which is the Lucky Cameraman. The Lucky Cameraman was from episode 67 to episode 70, part three, guys. So yeah, we can also see some other people and more. So like we got the uh, infected upgrade Titan Sp Speaker Man and... Uh, we also got that large cameraman that is burned for some weird reason. And we can make a uh, lucky cameraman get controlled, but I don't know how it's going to make me disinfect him. Oh, here we go. All right, and we also can make him run, but it's not really, like, working for this one. Hey, this guy's trying to make me explode. Well, that's not happening. And in episode uh, 69, part two, a lucky cameraman got, uh, or part one, I think. Uh, I forgot which episode it was, but lucky speaker man got, no, lucky cameraman. I keep forgetting their names, guys, which is weird. But if you press damage, oh, the if you guys remember from the claw toilet uh, uh, in episode uh, uh I forgot what, uh, oh, episode 70, part two, he got damaged, so this is him getting damaged, and he also has the ability to equip the device, and he could also, uh, this is the cool thing, guys, because he activates doors in the series, and uh, he could do this, and we can make him do it for a long period of time, and we could also make him uh, vanish, which is cool, and the other thing is, we actually, if you guys didn't know in this if episode, uh, no, the season 23 uh, in Skibbity Toilet, they had him, uh, there was a secret scene to him where we had the secret agent. This is him, guys. So he's pretty cool, right? So if you guys like uh, this uh, secret agent uh, one, then remember to like the video so I could get more likes than my usually videos. But I'm going to reset him to be honest with you, he's kind of glitched a little bit, but he's back to normal. All right, we got our next one, uh, Cameraman. So this is the normal Cameraman from series. It's just that they update him. He used to look really old and bad. But before I show you guys that, you could also get game passes over there. So uh, you guys can see there's game passes right there. We have uh, some weird, like, Titans and a Skibbity Toilet Titan Speaker Man, which is not in the real series. So I think it's from a multiverse. But if you guys didn't know, if you own VIP, you'll be able to own this. And you could also make the, you could make, like, the, like, morph, like, a different size. So uh, this, you can make him big or you can make him small, which is pretty cool. And... Uh, let's go to the cameraman's abilities. The first thing I noticed is he could get infected, so that's pretty cool. But I want to really let these guys be disinfected, so I don't want to really see that. Here we got uh, him punching, and you could also make him uh, have broken legs from some episodes. And we could also see that he could do a thumbs up, but it really looks like a Roblox, like they're just pointing at you or something. That's what it looks like, guys. So I have no idea why it looks like a point. I wish it was like a thumbs up more better, but it's fine. I'm not going to blame the creator of Roblox. Uh, I'm just saying, yeah. Next up, we got the new version of Speaker Man. He's pretty basic. He's just got, he can get infected and then he could get uh, disinfected. So I'm going to wait. Here we go. And we could also make him run. We can make him punch. We can make him do his normal Speaker Man dance, and we can make him die. So 
Uh, that's pretty a basic thing for a speaker, man, which is the funniest thing. But uh, I have more Morrison, guys. In the end of the video, keep watching because I'll be doing one of like the coolest morphs in the game that you probably really want to see. So next up, we got the Dark Speaker Man. He died in episode 70, part three, for to entertain all of us. So we, I'm not gonna really infect him because in the episode he didn't get infected. So episode 70, part three, we can make him fly, which is the coolest part, and we can also make him uh, punch. We can make him kick and we can make him do the no thing with his head and we can also make him uh, equip a spear with or knives so i'm gonna do the spear first and we can make him dance but i'm not gonna really do that so here's the spear i really don't like the spear but i i think i would like the what's it call it i think i like the knives better here so we can uh make him uh oh here we go swing down that's pretty cool to be honest with you, but still like not really like thing I would probably want to show on my channel, but that's fine. Here we in episode seventy part three, the scientist toilet actually uh made uh killed him, so this is what happened. He got split in the half. How did that happen, guys? No way. I oh my gosh. No way that oh my gosh. That is so cool. I he literally just spawned into a like What's it called? He spawned into a. I I I forgot what's called a, a. He spawned into a map. Well, I didn't expect that. All right. Well, we got uh, still some more to show. Next up, we got the TV man. They just updated him so he could. Uh, I thought he would like put the like. Was it called the smile on his face? But it's not showing it. But you can make him do his TV flash. It'll play the fe the upgraded Titan TV Man theme song, so it's pretty cool. We could also make him equip a knife, and uh, yeah. So the TV Man is pretty basic. I'm probably I don't really like him, but I I'm still showing you guys. So next up, we got the scientist TV Man. He's pretty cool. They updated him. Still the same thing that he has the same abilities as the. Uh, what's it called? He has the same abilities as the TV man, so he could do the TV flash. He could also equip his knife and swing it, and we could also make him uh, teleport to uh, uh, like places, which is really cool because in the real series, he had, the TV man can really teleport, including the Titan TV man, uh, large TV man, TV woman, so they could all like teleport to random places. This one I'm teleporting him to an example place which is called the camera lab. For some weird reason, I have no idea why it's called the camera lab. It's probably the one from episode 50, but I'm not really gonna mention about it. So we're gonna reset and we're gonna show you the rest of the more, so yeah. And what's weird guys is some of the morphs could have like normal like human skin and that's pretty like, cause they usually have like black skin or like gray skin, so. Uh, yeah, but I have no idea why they have tan skin. So we have the plunger cameraman. We could upgrade him from episode 70 part three and we can make him fly, which is the cool part. And we could also uh, make him, uh, what's it called? We can make him do a skilled kick. We could also make him equip his normal plungers. And I like how he's like just doing this and, uh, that's not the coolest thing though. We can make him do his real plunging animation. Then we can make him equip the spike plunger, which is more cooler. But the sad thing is he died in episode 70 part three. So this is what happened. So yeah, and there's a cool animation if you make him, look guys, that is so cool. He can literally walk like he's crawling like a zombie or something. We could also make him do critical damage, but he's just looking at his hands for some weird reason. I'm gonna spawn the next morph by just resetting this, so... Uh, oh god, I see a dark speaker man. Bro, what is this dark speaker man doing? I have no idea what he's doing, but he's just floating. Alright, next up we got the secret agent. They updated him too, he used to look weird, so... Uh, oh wait, guys, look, one of my friends actually joined in. I'm gonna s tell them uh, soon about something, but uh, I'm gonna show you the secret agent's power. So he can uh, uh, pretty much teleport uh, to any place, and we could also make him equip a gun, 
and uh, it's a normal thing. It, it's more cooler because it shoots like fake bullets, but yeah. We also got a knife and we can make him swing it right and left. So it's I know it's a basic thing, but we could also make him talk, guys. This is the coolest thing. So he's just like talking, but I'm gonna say that I like how he has the computers uh, on him, the green book, the camera and speaker man, like right near him, and he's talking to Plunger Cameraman from episode 70, part three. So the Skimby Toilet series, to be honest with you guys, is very cool. We can also make him do a green light, but that's from episode 67, so. Uh, I know there's a lot of episodes I mentioned about, guys, but that's uh, part of these morphs because they're from those episodes. So I like how he's, like, talking, guys. It's really cool. He's got, like, the, like, messy hair, I'm going to probably call it. But we have uh, two more, like, or actually three more new morphs for the, uh, like, Alliance member side, which means good team side. Then we have some new morphs for the Skibbity Toilet side. So we're almost done with this video, guys, but it'll... Uh, ends pretty soon, so. Oh, wait, guys, I didn't mean to morph into this guy. He's not the newest up there. I'm gonna reset him. Okay, guys, so let's see. Here we are. Uh, let's see. Alright, here we are. We're gonna. Our next morph is the large TV man from episode 70, part 3. They call him Large Speaker TV Man, which is a pretty weird name, but I. I, I probably agree that it's, like, weird, but we can make him punch and do some cool animations. We could also make him do the fog ability when he uh, makes the scientist toilet not like uh, like teleport to a different place. And we could also make him use a flash. Oh, guys, look, another friend of mine joined it. I hope they watch my video. All right, well, they also could, uh, you could also make him damage, which is cool. We could also make him say certain words like this. I'm not gonna really say it, guys, but it's pretty cool how he could say it, guys. Plus, my friend uh, Kylie came in here, so uh, she's one of my friends from school, guys. So don't worry, I'll tell her to watch this video as soon as I'm done with it. So, anyways, that's not all the morphs yet. So next up, we got the camera copter it's from episode 71 episode 71 is not the newest episode guys episode 72 part one is but i'll make another video for it uh soon but we can make him open up the doors and make him close it and uh we could also make him have rockets and he could shoot left and right it's pretty cool to be honest so i'm gonna and you could also make him crash because one of the camera copters in episode 71 got crashed and this is the real animation from it it's kind of pretty cool so it's like the real animation from the real skibbity toilet series but we, that's not all the units we have on this side. We have one more unit, which is the normal Titan TV man. And then I'll show you the uh, upgraded version of him. But it's from an old update. So here we got him. We can make him uh, look around. We can make him use his red screen, which is pretty cool. We could also make him use a grapple. And we could also upgrade him from episode 44. So it's pretty cool. So, yeah, and we can make him uh, do the same thing again, which is a red screen. So, it's pretty cool, guys. And we can also make him use his, uh, like, weird, like, claws on his back. And we could uh, make him uh, put, like, certain faces on him. Now, this guy, his, his, the TV man on this guy, his faces work. So, uh, I'm also going to reset him because he... Uh, yeah, so he's not, like, the most, like, coolest un uh, morph in this game. So I'm going to show you a couple more uh, morphs, and then we'll be done with this video. So the next morph we got over here, guys, is uh, the upgraded Titan Cinema Man. Now, he's, like, the best morph in the game. He's got a lot of abilities, but I'll show some of them. First up, we got his uh, red screen. We also got he has a coral laser from episode 67. It's pretty cool, to be honest. We could also make him detach, which is the coolest part of one of the morphs. We can make him, like, fire weird stuff, like pink screens, orange screens, and more. So it's a pretty cool thing, to be honest. We could also make him shoot lasers. So, yeah. And when you attach him, his body just, like, teleports where your the head is. So I'm going to reset him. And now we're going to go to the skibbity toilet side and see which uh, morphs we got here and i'm also going to show the uh some like 
cool uh, like uh, like morphs that are not new, but I'll still show them. So first up, we got the scientist toilet. He's pretty basic. He's from episode 67. So we can make him sing his song, and then we can make him break a can because Titan Speaker Man broke it. And then we can make him clip uh, the acid thing, and we can make him shoot it. But we could also make him explode it. We he has a lot of abilities, guys. So we can also make him shoot a laser. And it's pretty cool, but it could glitch out a little bit. So we also can make him block, and we could also make him break his speaker. And then he can. This is the crazy part. He has a TV, and then you can make him do the same thing like Titan TV Man. So I'm just gonna pretend like I'm doing it to uh, this upgraded Titan TV Man. He pretty looks cool, to be honest. We can also make him do a purple screen TV. But I'm gonna damage him. So first I'm gonna break the screen and then we could uh, like break him a lot. And we could also make him do a sound wave, which is pretty cool, but I really don't need him. So we're gonna just say that I'm gonna reset him. But yeah, that was just a morph and that person probably thought uh, I was doing a role play with him, but I'm actually not. So here's one of my friends. I'm gonna tell him I'm actually doing a video. Hold on, guys. I'm just going to tell him something. All right, here we go. And, uh, yeah, I just told him, so I hope he uh, doesn't, like, yeah. And next up, guys, we got another scientist toilet. Now, there, I know there's a lot of them, but we got the one from Episode 70, Part 3. And uh, we have him to attempt his teleport, and it's pretty cool, but... We can also make him fail his teleport, and we can make him malfunction. We can also make him sing, and we can make him stab. And, and we can uh, make him do more cool stuff, like we can make him shoot his laser. He can fly, and he also can get speared. His eye can be hurt, and uh, he's got some pretty more cool abilities, and it's pretty cool so far, so I really like it. So uh, yeah, that's for him because I'm, uh, I'm gonna start wrapping up a little bit, guys. So I'm just gonna show you three more morphs, or actually no, two more morphs. They're, they're pretty like basic morphs, so they're gonna be quick morphs. So right here we got the Mech Scientist, which is very cool. He can laugh and we can make him fire his lasers and we could make him break his glasses. It's pretty cool, guys and he's shooting his laser so far and he could also be malfunction so he's pretty cool so far but we have one more morph guys and then we're done with the video so i'm trying to wrap it up as like fast as i can so yeah all right here and my friend is still like walking around and he hasn't even picked his morph all right next up we got the normal g-man from multiverse he's not a toilet so the alliance members were toilets in the multiverse version but uh, i'll talk about that another time but we can make him uh bigger guys so we can make him serious mode and uh we can also make him get hurt and then we can make him shoot uh laser eyes which is pretty cool and it's pretty cool so far we also can make him uh, do skibbity toilet talk which is pretty like creepy and we could also upgrade him he could do a laser blast and we could also make him an angry mode so it's it's pretty cool guys but i think we should start wrapping up because that's the last morph so uh, i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video remember to do the same thing remember to like and subscribe and if you guys are one of my friends watching this video i hope you enjoyed it and uh, i'll figure out the next game if you guys are my friends watching this but yeah guys that's it for my video i hope you enjoyed remember to like and subscribe to the channel remember what the sign i'm holding up right now says it says like subscribe and hit the notification bells on but yeah guys that's it for today's video i hope you enjoyed and i'll see you guys in the next video bye